What is going on guys? My name is Gaze and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video on the channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Japanese Black Ops 3 gameplay. Now first of all, I do want to shout out Puma's Revenge for being part of the notification squad. Thank you, I appreciate it. Just like, comment, subscribe, and turn on my notifications to be a part of that. And also shout out to Mac Max Mango and Itan Kid for the idea of this video. Their links will be below. And we're just going to hop straight into it um, and just see what's up with this okay now i'm from the united states of america and we're gonna see the differences between our black ops 3 or my black ops 3 versus japanese black ops 3 so let's just do it all right so the gameplays will be linked below as well so go check it out but first if you guys notice let me just lower this a little bit first things first the ammo count and the font of the whole game, you can already tell straight off the rip that it is different, it's more thinner, and the ammo, like the font for Black Ops 3 in Murica is a bit thicker and it's curvier in my opinion, um, if you just look at it. So you can definitely tell by the ammo count, that's where it's most changed. And another thing, and another, we'll get into it. I wanna talk to you guys about this part right here. Listen up, where it says this. For that part, I listened to multiple gameplays, and it says Reaper something something. I don't know. I'm not Japanese. But then in another part, it just said KIA activated or, like, some other specialist and didn't even say, um, like, it in Japanese. So why was that different? The Ripper had some Japanese after it, but another specialist that I watched didn't. I don't know. I, I don't know. Another thing while watching this, if you guys noticed on the bottom right corner, it says CUDA and then it has Japanese language there. And it's kind of weird that it puts the original CUDA in English and then the Japanese version. I'm guessing that's how you spell CUDA in Japanese. Uh, it's interesting that they do that though, because it's like, this is a Japanese version of the game. We're gonna take off the spectacles because you can really see the reflection. I know I look like a potato, but you can definitely tell the difference and it's interesting to see why 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 do that why put the english version and then the japanese version i feel i don't know if that's in every foreign country if it's like that where they have the their the english version and then their country's version i i don't know but i think that's a cool thing to just pick up on another thing that i just realized right there that's interesting on the on the left side of the screen where it says uav they have it in Japanese, UAV, and then more Japanese. They don't have it in just fully Japanese because I think it says, like, friendly or UAV inbound. It's, like, free-for-all, so I don't know what it, I think it says friendly UAV inbound. But they don't have it just full in Japanese. They had, like, the score streaks and some of the specialists. I believe they have the specialists in Japanese and the guns, like, the primary stuff in the game. I'm not sure if they have the attachments or not. I'll check that out after. All right, so my camera SD card got full so i don't know what the last thing you guys heard of me was but i was saying the text it's different when you get a uav and it says it in english and then their you know language it's like the main weapons I'm, I'm hoping you guys heard that part but uh let's move on i'm hoping that there's some more stuff we can look at on the next gameplay all right so going on what i was saying before about the specialist gun and all that you see it says the english version of ripper and then in japanese so it looks like they're doing that for the score streaks and the specialist and the um the guns i'm not sure if they're doing it for the attachments though hopefully i can see that later wait yeah it looks like it yeah vmb fmj they're doing it for all the main priority stuff like that they're just putting it in english because yeah it's interesting actually Okay, so I tried for VMP, and in Japanese, it's, uh, it's VMP. But if you try for CUDA, it's actually different. So it's interesting that they didn't just put that in the game and then, like, what it actually is in Japanese. They interesting. Let's see, let's put Ripper here. Yeah, so, smiley face, hey. But that's what Ripper is in Japanese. So it's in There it is. Outright, they're gay, yeah, yeah. All right, so moving on to the second gameplay. I started it. I watched it before. And then they also do add some stuff in English, like this part. She's down. And then some other parts, they have their Japanese language. So that that's, that's interesting. 
All right, so skipping through, you would notice that actually none of the voices in this gameplay is in Japanese, but in the other one it was, so that's a bit of a difference. Be advised, hostile reps deploy ship in your AO. There you go, that part. All right, so there's basically the gameplay, and you just guys, you saw the differences between English version, if you're in the Americas, and just English, whatever. Uh, but you definitely did see a difference. It's kind of interesting how they include English stuff in this game as well. So props to that. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys are from a different country and your Black Ops 3 is different than this, let me know down in the comments below and what's different about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have yourselves a great day. Stay fresh as always. Subscribe. And peace out. Also, big thank you to all the YouTubers I mentioned before. Links below once again. Hello, hello, hello.